I would say our most common weed is thistles. Um, common sunflowers, you'll see a lot of sunflowers. Our dirt roads are terrible with sunflowers. That's pretty much it. We, we're, we're seeing a lot more poison hemlock this year than, we, than I seen last year anyway. Um, probably due to the drought last summer. And that's probably why our thistles are bad this year too, is because everything opened up last, last summer. You know, everything, when it dried out and everything cracked open, I mean, we're, all, of, all, of our, all of our weed seed took, that's for sure. This is one I found doing this township. And I was like, oh my gosh. I mean, all those nice houses and, and they have to put up with this stuff right here. That's kind of makes you feel bad. I mean, because you want it to look better. This right here is poison hemlock. That's very noxious to people. It'll kill cattle, horses. Um, it's, it's bad stuff. Anytime there's a road sign and there's, and, uh, so just say for instance, there's a tree or some weeds that are gonna be blocking that road sign. I, I usually gas them. I usually put chemical to them. I have to mark everything down where, where I'm going, where I've been, um, how much chemical I used, uh, wind speed, temperature, um, at uh, 8 o'clock, 10 o'clock, 12 o'clock, every two hours. I have, to, I have to write down our temperatures. And then I just highlight the road that I've been on. I have to keep track of all that for ideals. Um, for their records. All my chemical mixes at the pump, so I don't have any live chemical overnight. I have three separate tanks, three separate pumps to keep different chemicals in. I mix my chemical at the shop and put it in at the shop because I cannot pour chemical into my tanks on the right of way. There's just a lot of neat stuff. Uh -huh. All over Woodbury County, you just need to get out and, and, uh, right. and look. We're gonna clean it up.